guys, welcome back to another episode of How to Hack Ethical Series. Today I am going to show you how to hack and exploit printers in seconds. Let's see how easy it is to hack, how to get full control to your printers, capture and start sending documents our way. So all future print jobs that are going to come across the printer we've connected to which are going to start spooling over. Why I chose to show you this? I chose to show you this because hackers can hack your printers easy and steal any of your secret documents or whatever. Do you own a printer? If so, it may be vulnerable to hackers. Multiple HP LaserJet printers are printer vulnerable according to a new advisory posted by the vendor, dubbed as CVE-2013-4807. The main issue is with some of the network printers having hidden URLs hardcoded in the firmware, which can be accessed without authentication. The vulnerability could be exploited remotely to gain unauthorized access to data. For example, if you own any HP LaserJet printers, then you can access the printer configuration through this URL https colon slash slash i p address slash dev slash save underscore resto dot xml where the password seems to be encrypted but it is very simple to decrypt this configuration xml file stores password using hex encoding anyone can decrypt this password online in seconds look at this example Hash value 7465737467765 F7765 simply decoded into plain text. So, Testo is the admin password of this printer. This way hackers can take full control of your printer in seconds. Also, if that printer is Wi-Fi enabled, then your Wi-Fi password and other sensitive information can be extracted from using URL. HTTPS colon slash slash I. E address. 8080, IOM GMT, adapters, Wi-Fi 0, WPS pin. Again we can see a configuration XML file, but look at the security of the file, it's simply displaying Wi-Fi password in plain text format. Anyone who have access to this URL can read your Wi-Fi password. Moreover these URLs have no authentication and authorization controls. By any chance, if these vulnerable printers are exposed to internet, hackers can easily access your printers using your public IP address. In current days, many companies and government agencies exposing their printers to internet. Imagine the risk level. How to secure your printer? Here are some examples to secure your printer and that you should consider. 1. Change the default password immediately upon printer installation and use a complex and lengthy password. 2. By default you may find that your printer has an external or public IP address. Unless there's a very good reason for keeping it that way, switch to an internal IP address. For extra security, consider limiting access to a specific LAN or subnet. 3. By default many ports like SMTP, FTP, Telnet, USB and Web are enabled. Make sure to disable unused ports using the web management interface to cut back the potential for an attack. 4. Make sure you always download the latest version of firmware from your manufacturer's website. This may contain fixes for serious security issues or new features that could make your printers more secure. That's all for today guys. Hope this video helps. We publish these types of education content every week. To stay up to date and aware of such cyber risks, and learn about more hacking tools, consider subscribing to my channel by clicking on the subscribe and bell button on the top right corner of the page. Thanks for watching. See soon.